the two most important men in my life coming to the concert with me Jung Hyun and my bestie Dernière transmission du vaisseau Andromeda. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, last tour of my room before I leave. Because I'm, I'm gonna miss this hotel room. So again we have... So, the shiny concert in Toronto was absolutely amazing. Some fans complained that it wasn't exactly a full concert, three hours long. They did have a bit of difficulty in the beginning. Um, it was supposed to open gate at 7. That was the. Oh, actually, it was supposed to be open gate at 6 o'clock. That was delayed to 6.30, then to 7. The concert started at 8, and apparently it wasn't 3 hours long, but I, know, I didn't notice. It was just. I was having the time of my life, so I didn't notice. Um, those minor bumps in the road. Um, yep. Truly amazing. So this is your wall length mirror. Oh, look at this line. I feel like a saint. Mm -hmm. um, here we have a little microwave and this is not a fridge it's a uh, cooling something three dollars make sure that i don't forget anything the gdn bible which is technically well aligned laundry bag and empty okay so i didn't need anything my two phones currently charging. A little um, brew yourself coffee tea station. The only glass I used. Small trash can. Your mandatory essential where to go into lock to. <coughs> Sorry, my voice. And the Zibaterumi. So this hotel, um, I don't know, something ecological, like everything about these guys is ecological, which is pretty nice. Small towels, the towels are used, and, and that one. Shower was amazing, like, oh, just perfect. Uh, this super neat hair dryer. Soap, my stuff. And yeah, the shampoo and body wash or shower gel of, of this sort too. And here we have a small indentity and a small bench. My stuff. The main study desk. And uh, most, I mean, this bed was just ridiculously huge, but amazing. Like, I slept good last night. I was finally able to sleep from, well, I went to bed at past 2, 2 a.m. I listened to Jung Hyun's bass until 3.30ish, maybe 4, I don't know, I sort of dozed off. Then I woke up again, start, stopped my MP3, my, my phone, my Samsung. And I finally slept on my own until like almost 8, like a few minutes before it because my body always wakes up before the alarm clock, it's just how I am programmed to be. So the only souvenir that I got from Toronto is this pink Blue Jay baseball bat. I went to the official Blue Jays shop, it was, it was near the uh, Toronto Aquarium, 
which is advertised. We sort of went to that section, my ticket back home, my uh, hotel room card. Six o six. We are the twentieth. I am leaving. The welcome card. This was also this was a gift from one of the Japanese fans. And this another gift that I got after the concert from on the Japanese fan. I think. Well, it's Japanese candy, and she asked me which one was my favorite, and obviously, Jogi Wongi. I'm gonna eat this in the, the bus back home. And then the light stick that I got from that other amazing Japanese fan who collected light sticks of all sorts and brought us Canadians because something went wrong and we couldn't order enough from China and ship it in time for the concert so the Japanese showers gathered light sticks and they flew all the way here to bring it to us which is absolutely amazing uh, my jewelry so I was wearing obviously my Jung Hyun bracelet that I assembled already two years ago, I think. I started in October and it was a bit of a work in progress, but now it's completely assembled in focus. Yes, you can. And this was my necklace, uh, the cool cat meow, <laughs> which is also in, on his bracelet. And my bestie, who obviously came with me at the concert in mind, even though he was in Bulgaria. Bulgaria. Um, my other bracelet um, on the odd album team with the pool and the water and love like oxygen, life saving stuff. And the last one, uh, I don't know if you can make it on the bottom, it spells R E A L, real K G H. And it I try to have like a um, shiny kind of color bead and Jagnyun is pretty much peace and love and the cherry is for um, obvious reasons my notebook this is my indications uh, from the bus drop off to the hotel, which two and um, last night, they are just a little small. <laughs> uh, we got colored pencils in the small giveaway thingy at the um, VIP venue, and my indications from the hotel back to the bus. Uh, stop, drop the game, whatever. Lappy toppy. And this was my. So I bought the SMVIP package thingy. Oh, come on. And this was my amazing ticket. And yeah, um, BB45 was like holy shit smack in the center. It was pretty cool. And yeah, so we have this. Let's go back to the top. Okay, yeah, I got a song stuck in my head at the moment, so... Uh, yesterday, while we were doing the city tour, we had a break from 2 to 4.30ish. And I was thinking of... Well, I hopped at in the... Um, 
Is it the Eaton Center, whatever thingy downtown? I was thinking of watching a movie. I was ideally opting for Get Out, but it was like only at, it started at 4:15, which was yeah, not gonna happen. Oh, interesting. So then it was a potentially a Beauty and the Beast at three, which was close to my time. And I was like, no, nah. so I just went outside, walked around, saw the street performing arts, and I made my socks. <laughs> Table, love seat. And then I just headed back to the where the bus was stationed. It was 4 o'clock, I still had time. So I went to a church, St. Michael's, I think. I have to check my previous video. Uh, prayed a little, thanked God and everybody for this amazing, <laughs> amazing experience, and then headed back home to the hotel. And so, this is my um, package thingy. And okay, so I, um, the the staff member actually was in the room right next to mine. I'm um, 626, she was 624. Just not coincidence, I guess. So here we have the CD tour and the concert was just slightly delayed. Um, so any recording device such as digital camera, video camera is not permitted during the event except cell phone if you get caught, carrying device. Using venue securities will delete all data, tape, and memory sticks, and you will ask me for us to go out. Um, honestly, I was panicking in the beginning to charge my phone and be ready, but then when you were in the concert and I was second row from the stage, it was basically impossible to get my phone out and just not focus on the concert.